Good morning. 502, March 11th, 2011. I keep thinking about starting one of those bloggy thingies, but don't really know what a bloggy thingy is. I like the name Molly Coddle. Don't y'all think that sounds like a ruffly name? Like ruffles added to some cute dress or something? But it's got all these different meanings in some ways, or all these different ways that you can apply it to your life. So I'm sitting outside and I thought I could do a video to where you could see me, but it's probably better off that you can't, seeing how it's just after five in the morning. The birds are starting to wake up. I don't live in the country. I live two miles from a Walmart. My neighbors just turned their light on. Hope they can't hear me. They'll think I'm crazy. But I do live in the yard at the base of a mountain where you can hear the birds coming alive in the mornings and the chickens will start making some noise but it's very peaceful i kind of feel molly coddled by god which is a good thing for sure because gosh my life here lately has been let's just say i've not had a lot of molly coddling uh, except for by God and my husband who's wonderful but we sure have been stressed any of you out there have teenagers that you're scared every single moment of every single day for maybe it's because they've been molly coddled too long do you know what molly coddle means means like to be pampered and in my 50 year old brain you know to me that's like going to a spa or something and getting manicure and pedicure and facial and massage and oh ma'am would you like a cup of coffee or a cup of tea I've never ordered a cup of tea Depends on what time it is, whether I take the coffee. Would you like a glass of wine? Sure, but if I have one, I'll probably have five. That's why I quit June last year, 2020. Picked up these stupid things. So, Anyway, I think I want to start a blog. I think I'm going to call it Molly Coddled. And we'll talk about all the different ways how that can be good and how that can be bad and um, talk about God, talk about depression, talk about Depression over loved ones that we have that may be innocent, may be guilty, struggling with their own depression, struggling with their own PTSD, all the stupid drugs out there right now. I hate them. As I puff this stupid thing. Trying to molly coddle myself in some sort of way. <laughs> All right. I got two Shih Tzus on my feet. It's dark. I hope no critter comes up to my chair. Especially an armadillo. I hate those things. They're so nasty. There's nothing roughly about them. They're just... Yeah. 
and chipmunks. They're so cute, but... Oh, by the way, squirrel. Okay, so I got to do some research on blogging for dummies. I'll get back to you.